Hi, this is Teresa, and today I have a slightly different focus for the video. Robin introduced me to this cute little shop in Charlotte, North Carolina, the Good Postage Store. They have a huge assortment of Caveco pens, including the new Art Sport pens. I believe that this one is my favorite. They have, as you can see, all of the pretty colors, and they're all beautifully arranged in these little glass jars. This frosted pen is nice. I was most tempted, however, by this clear demonstrator pen. Can you believe that I did not know that Caveco made a demonstrator pen? It's so pretty with the clear resin and the silver clip. This distressed denim pen would have been my second choice. I just loved the distressed blue color. Wow, this brass pen was heavy. The shop also has a small selection of Lamy Safari pens. Of course, the turquoise one is my favorite. They also have the Caveco clips. And again, everything is displayed in these nice little glass cups. I was only afraid that I was going to knock the cups over. And the owner kept giving me nervous side glances. And here are the ink cartridges for the Cavecos. And they also have a sizable selection of Colorverse inks. As well as a large selection of stickers. But what I was primarily interested in looking at was their stationary products. And my focus was on the Traveler's Notebook products. They have both the regular and passport size notebooks. And they also carry all of the accessory items. Including these little cardboard hardboards that you can put behind your notebook page to write with and the clips. I've been wanting one of these brass travelers clips and they have all of the notebook inserts. Plain page, dot grid, and they also have a range of colors in their Delphonics bags. Robin purchased this blue one and gave it to me as a gift. I did not know that Caveco had student pens either. These are very nice. I like the size in hand, and they remind me a little bit of sailor pens. They are very nice. This is an outside view of the shop and surrounding area. It's an entertainment slash dining venue called Camp North End and was refurbished from an industrial commercial site.
There's a children's play area. And this complex is very close to Center City, Charlotte. You can see the tops of the tallest buildings in the distance. Those clouds looked ominous. And a storm did happen right after I filmed this segment. But it had been hot that day, and it cooled off the air very nicely. It felt wonderful. So this is my new Traveler's Passport Notebook. And this is part of the packaging that it came in. With some instructions. And everything was wrapped and double wrapped in plastic, of course. And it came in a little cloth, little linen bag. The leather looks and smells so good. Here is some use and care instructions. I've just started setting it up. This is the owner's business card with her name and information inside. And this passport stamp was put in the book by the owner. I've just started setting this up. I've put in some uh, monthly calendar spreads. And these are some of my own stamps. And this is the Traveler's Brass Clip. I've been wanting one of these for a long time. I just love the look and feel of this. And this is a cardboard card that can be used as a guide for writing and has a grid and some measurements along the edge. This is another insert notebook and I've started a few lists in here. The paper is so nice and smooth. This is another insert that can be purchased. It has a Ziploc pouch on one side and some card insert slots on the other side and you can just slide it in underneath your notebook inserts. And here I have a pen holder, which is sold separately. It just slides onto the uh, cover of the notebook. And this is the pen that I found that best fits the pen holder, my new Pilot E95S, which I will be reviewing later on. I'm really enjoying having this Traveler's Passport, passport size notebook. I'm expecting to get, get a lot of use from it. I like the small, convenient carry size. Here are two postcards from the store. This one shows Howard Carter opening Tut's sarcophagus. 
They are vintage postcards. There are also stamps available to purchase at the store. And this postcard is from Victoria Station, which used to be our all-time favorite restaurant in the Charlotte area. They had the best food and the best salad bar and the best chocolate dessert. What do you think of my purchases? The Traveler's Notebooks are wildly popular right now. Do you have a Traveler's? Leave me a comment. Thank you for watching.